In this guide, I'll show you how to fix packet loss on your Xbox Series S or X. So the first thing you want to do is power cycle your home network in Xbox. So press and hold the X button on your controller, and you want to turn it off fully and unplug the power cable from the back for 30 to 60 seconds. Then at the same time, you want to do this on your home network. So unplug your modem and or router for 30 to 60 seconds as well, then plug everything back in and boot up your Xbox and see if there's still packet loss. Now, if you're still experiencing problems, let's go to settings at the top. Then we're going to scroll over to network settings and select it. Now, ideally, you'd be using a wired connection over Wi-Fi, as this is going to provide a more fast, stable internet. However, if you're set on using Wi-Fi, ensure your Xbox is as close to your router as possible without any obstructions in the way. And then let's go to advanced settings. From here, we're going to select DNS settings. And in some cases, using a custom DNS can be faster than using the automatic DNS. So we're gonna select manual, and from here, we're gonna enter in the Google DNS, and I already have it in. So it's 8.8.8.8, .8 and another very fast DNS you could try is the Cloudflare DNS, which is 1.1.1.1. Then press the menu button on your controller, and if you wanna use the Google DNS, type in 8.8.4.4, .4. and if you wanted to try the Cloudflare DNS, type in 1.0.0.1. .1. Then press the menu button and go back, and it's going to test your connection. And then under network settings, go to test network speed and statistics to ensure you're not getting any packet loss. This guide was helpful, like and subscribe, and we'll see you in the next one.